Microsoft Excel comes in with a lot of uh, features that are good for the interface. In this video, we are going to explore what is called a themes that falls under page layout. So themes allows you to be able to set certain colors to be able to be used within a certain Microsoft Excel a workbook or a worksheet. So in this example, we're going to help you to one to set up uh, the theme that you'd want by choosing um, the default already loaded. Two, you can customize it. And third, we're going to show you how you can set the default theme that you would have uh, created your custom theme to become the default theme for your Microsoft Excel. So let's jump into right now and see how it goes. So by default, if you come here to page uh, page layout, you'll see that a uh, Microsoft uh, Excel colors that comes with all the charts, it is this blue and this orange. And it is because the default theme here, it is Office. So let's say if you want it to be facet, you see it changes to be light green and dark green. And you can even go to main event, where it has even a different font, different colors. We can also browse for themes uh, online, or we can also save the current theme. So the themes, they are based uh, on these three elements, the colors, the font, and the effects. So in this uh, uh, tutorial, we are going to customize the colors so that we, we are able to create our own color. So let's say accent one, we want it to be purple, and then accent two to be a lighter purple, and then accent three, we want it uh, to be this blue, and then accent four, we want it uh, to be this brown. And then here we save it as uh, our theme, and then we say save. So as you can see, this is the theme that we've selected. That is going to be the default one. So in the, if you want to change the font here, you can change it area or whatever you choose. And then the effects, usually you have to choose if it's 3D or any others. I would like to leave it on where it is by default. So once you've done this, it means that you've created your own theme. So if you come here to themes here, you'll see that uh, we, we have uh, the, 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 the theme that we would have created, we have selected the color, and here it is the color that would want to say our, our theme, this one. It is one that is being affected. So once we have it like this, then it means that now uh, we have to be able uh, to save this theme. So for us to be able to save this theme, what we need to do is to create a, bl a blank um, Excel um, workbook by pressing Ctrl N on the keyboard. So once we've done this, come into page layout, we come here, as you can see, it defaults to the office theme and we say our theme is a default. And then here, we're going to press Ctrl S on the keyboard to save it. Uh, I would like to save it in a file called Excel Start. But for now, since we'd like to search it all around, uh, let's come here to desktop and then here we save here. So let's make sure that here we save it as a book only. We don't need to define book two or what. And then here we have to save it as a template. So let's look for the template here. So is the template as we go down here, right? So here it is the template. So once we've done this, uh, we're on the, on the desktop. So let's go to desktop here and then we save it like that. Please remember to remove the number so that it only remains book only. And then we say save. So once we've done this, it means that we have saved uh, that document with um, a, the theme as a template. And once we do this now, we can close this, um, this one here and we say save. And then we come here on our computer here. So it means that now we are able to uh, to search for that uh, Excel start. In this example, I have already searched it. And this is the version of the, of the Excel that I'm using. And I, I click here. So now we, may, we need to cut it. Right click here and say cut. And then uh, press Ctrl V to paste it. Once we've done this, so once we've done this, it means now the, every time we're going to open Excel, yeah, it means that theme now will be the default theme for whatever we are going to do. So as you can see by default, it is already changed to our theme is the default one. I have not selected anything. So this is how you're able to set up the default for your themes in Microsoft um, 
yeah, excel so they look good and look better always. So I would like to say uh, thank you for watching this video. I hope it has been very, very useful and I would like to say bye for now and see you in the next video.